Okay, so we're here with BAFL Breaks Are For Losers. Um, so, this game, uh, well, this review is going to be a shorter one because this is quite a simple game. Um, there's not really much to this game. Um, and, uh, yeah, so, basically, um, it's a... Uh, racing game but um it's not like mario kart where you're in a first person view this is more like um as you can see here um is more like an old uh, arcade style game back when you know the arcade cabinets couldn't really um couldn't really do first person so um they did it from this top down perspective and this does make it quite awkward to control. Um, so, just to elaborate here, there's no accelerate button. You're always accelerating. Um, and it, uh, um, you have to press left and right according to what the car is facing. Which is which isn't too bad. Yeah, that's quite easy to get used to. So yeah, it's um, a little bit tricky to get used to. And as you can see, yeah, I'm just completely just like flailing around. You go there to repair your vehicle, and if you do like break the car, it does repair itself automatically, but it only repairs itself a little bit, and um, it takes it longer. As you can see here. Um, I just got a completely wrecked there when it was just Anyway. Um, this seems, to me at least, more from what, what I've played, and I've only played one race, uh, because it wasn't that fun, on my own, it seems like one of those games that you would play with a friend or two, um, you, you know, it's just like one of those games where you play, you'd mess around, um, and you'd have a bit of a laugh, but, um, the thing is, this though this type of game, you know, that you know, it's not that fun on your own. Like you're playing it on your own in your bedroom, it's like, yeah. Well, that was not bad. I mean, on its own, it's not bad. I mean, it's not enjoyable either. But um, I would definitely say um, it would be better with friends. Um, and of course, here here we have upgrades. So. Earn money, and then you can just like buy upgrades, and um, so there's like acceleration, mm -hmm. steering, wheels, and all that. Um, so yeah, but um, it, I got it because of, I think it was 89p um, on the sale, which is ending today. So um, you know, get to you know get all the games you want on the sale, you know today, um, and uh, yeah. Uh, but it was 89p, I was like, yeah, it, it, it'll be fun to uh, play when Jack's found one day, whenever he, when he eventually, he can be bothered to get him down, so I'll probably make another video separate to this video on it, just playing it with him, um, but yeah, this is definitely one of those games that you uh, um, have for like, having friends over, so um, if you have like, um, little kids who have friends over there, they probably quite enjoy this. Um, or if you yourself just um, have friends over um, on even like a somewhat regular basis, and th this would definitely be a good game to play with them. Um, and I, I definitely say it would be easier if you uh, um, have played this type of top-down game racing game before. Um, but because I haven't, it's a little bit tricky for me, so yeah. Um, all in all, it's a decent game. <laughs> right now it's 89p, and I think um, off sale it'll be like one quid or something like that. Uh, not much more than 89p right here. I think it'll, it'll probably like go up to two quid off the sale, so it, it's alright, you know, get, get, get a few friends around, have a bit of fun. Um, but yeah, that's all I really have to say about it. Um, this just goes, uh, pretty much just goes over 
um, one tournament. There's different modes as well as challenge mode, which I'm, I've heard like there's some really difficult challenges, like um, there's a challenge to not to even touch the walls. So yeah, if you like really hard challenges and, and stuff like that, then um, that'll probably keep you entertained for a while. But um, for the like the you know casual, um, just like uh, guy who doesn't have many friends, this isn't really um, a great game to get. Um, because like I said, it's only good if you have friends around. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Decent game. If you have friends round, if you don't have friends round, then you're not really gonna get much um, enjoyment out of it. Um, but if you if you want a racing game that's fun when you have friends over, and and this doesn't have online by the way, it doesn't have online from what I've seen. So yeah, if had if it had online, if it had online, then this would probably be a lot better. Like, just like, get your friend up on the, on the other switch, it's like, hey, Skype call me while we play this online, it's like, yeah, and then, you know, that would make this game a lot better, but no, no online functionality, so, yeah, that, 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 that would be, like, they should, they should make that like DLC, like, or an update or something, um, it's like, online multiplayer, like, probably make it free because, it's really one of those things that should have just come with the game in the first place. But anyway. Um, yeah, like I said, pick it up if you uh, have some if you have friends over regularly, but if you don't really have any friends over regularly then I definitely say give this a skip. Um, if you wanna save 89 p or yeah, whatever. Anyway, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.
Two, one. Two, one, go! Two, one, go!